Hello guys, welcome back with me, Chow Chow 2025 in Persona 3 FES Answer. Yeah, this is gonna be a new series. We're gonna play the answer. I hear it's not really a great uh, game, you know. The gameplay is really bad since every enemy has like evasion bonus on your weakness on their weakness you know so it's gonna be a lot of evasion enemy and that's really annoying so I'm gonna plan to play this game until the end but I'm probably gonna use cheat along the way maybe later on the game when it's a little too boring because there will be a lot of grinding and a lot of dungeon random battles that you know I'm here for the story so that's what I do that's what I'm gonna do new games this options allow you to find out what happened after the event of the main story of Persona 3 we recommended that player finish the journey before playing this chapter. The combat difficulty is also higher in this chapter compared to the normal storyline. Enjoy the increased challenge. Yeah. This ordeal, it may be that we brought it upon ourselves. that a future exists, and being able to access it, are very different things. We did not understand such an obvious and natural principle yet. Indeed, we understood very little. We knew nothing about using the key to open the path to the future. Some time before the incident, March 30th, 2010, 1.30 p.m. Fuka. Hello? Uh, Yukari-chan, it's me. Um, are you coming today? Oh, uh, didn't you see the message I left on the board? I have cram school today. I know, but... I left all the stuff at the dorm, so I don't have to be there in person, right? I suppose not, but... Are you okay with that? Yeah, I'm gonna pass. Oh, sorry. Break's almost over. I gotta go. Tell everyone I said hi, okay? Sit, Yukari. Yukari-chan's not coming after all. Sonata-san said he's busy at the gym. 
So I doubt he'll be here in time either. Man, what's up with those two? The dorm's closing down today. With all our memories of this place, you'd think they'd want to see it off, right? It can't be helped. They just see things differently. Everyone started down their own chosen path. It's a good thing. You're right. I can hardly blame them. They seem to get busier and busier. If I didn't have to reclaim these, I might not have made it either. So we finally gotta give up our evokers. Damn. I hate to let it go, but it's not like I got a use for it anymore. Let's see, two, four... Wait, how many are there supposed to be? I guess... I believe this is all of them. Huh? You had one too, I guess, son? I'd forgotten. You had his for safekeeping. Hey, come on. Don't get all gloomy again. I don't think that's the way he would have wanted to see this end. I'm sorry. You're right. We all said our goodbyes to him. But I still wonder, why did it happen? What happened? What? The doctors didn't find anything wrong with him afterward. It just seemed like he fell asleep, didn't it? He must have used up all his power to protect us at that last battle. Damn. It's useless to try and guess at the reasons why. I am certain he didn't blame anybody for what happened. Yeah, Aichan's got that right. Hey, but I'm glad to see you're still hanging in there, I guess. Back then, it was like he was all you could think about. I'm... somewhat surprised as well. It's possible that I will not feel the full impact until I am alone tomorrow at the lab. Huh? The lab? Are you planning to commute to school from there next semester? Oh... no, I... I guess is returning herself to the lab tomorrow. She won't be enrolled as a senior. Damn it, I guess. Seriously? Why? Can't she stay in school like before? The decision was mine. I'm sorry I didn't mention it sooner. I enjoyed being with you all, but I need to find my own way of life. Oh. But you can come visit me anytime. I guess. Think of it as a new beginning for her. The beginning of the end. Anyway, we seem to have gotten on the wrong track, but today's not meant to be a sad occasion. I've ordered excellent sushi for us all, the same as before actually. We may not have been able to get everyone together. But we should all have dinner here tonight. Yeah. Oh, that, that would be great. You got that sushi again? Sweet. No objections here. You're gonna join us, right, I guess? Of course. I couldn't miss spending time with you all. I guess this is her robotic speech. The number of apathy syndrome cases is down from last month, which seems to mark an end to the strange illness. However, surveys show that the number of people who report serious stress in everyday life has not decreased. 
according to research carried out by the Ministry of Health and Welfare. Oh, when did it get so late? It's almost midnight. Dark hour. It's hard to believe we've spent the evening doing nothing. But it is easy, man. Sitting here like this reminds me of those days. Perhaps that's why. I think I can understand. I have so many memories of this lounge that I find myself spending time here for no reason. It's the same for me. When I'm here, I think about when we were still fighting. It's strange, since my memories of that time are more painful than happy. Well, all that stuff aside, doesn't something feel weird to you guys? I'll be walking around and people act like as long as they're happy right now, nothing else matters. Those stupid stories that Strega spread around are still out there, you know? Makes me think, is this what we almost died to protect? Are you saying people don't know how good they have it? <laughs> You're sounding like an old man. He is an old man. Hey, who asked you? That's out of our hands, I'm afraid. We prevented the fall, but we can't reform society. Yeah, be a teacher like you did Tosi. Yeah, I guess, but still. And that's the weather. At the tone, the time will be midnight. What was that? Dark hour. Midnight. It can't be. Is it the dark hour again? Nah, everything's fine out there. Wait, the news. Good evening. It is now March 31st. Here's a recap of the news from the 30th. What the hell? The 31st was yesterday, right? Did the anchor misread the date? Hey, is that all? Even they make mistakes every once in a while. It's nothing. Weird. My cell says it's the 31st too. Well, looks like a false alarm. Another Groundhog Days. So far, I'd agree. But something felt... off. <sighs> it's late. We should call it a night. What a lame finish to our last day in the dorm. <sighs> um... Would it be alright if I returned to my room? I have to prepare to move tomorrow. Sure. Good night, I guess. Night. I'd best contact Yukari and Akihiko, just in case. An hour later, in Aegis' room. When I close my eyes, I remember the last moment I spent with him. The day he fell asleep, we brought him back to our dorm, fear beginning to well up within us. And the next morning, our fears became reality, and he was lost to us. For some time after that, I fell into depression, and began seeing the same dream, night after night. A dream where I run after him, calling his name, but can never catch up. When he was alive, I promised to protect him, 
and I made that my reason for living. That promise is gone. Unfulfilled. Then, one day, my sadness suddenly left me, as if a prison door had swung open. I stopped dreaming, and I no longer required sleep. <sighs> it's no use. I can't sleep. Can I really continue living like this? Yes. Huh? A butterfly? going on? I guess, are you awake? Yes, I am. The door is open. I guess, we need you! Has something happened? It's not... another enemy, is it? It's hard to describe. The lobby floor opened up and... Uh, anyway, we need to hurry to the lounge! Understood. What the hell's happened? Come to think of it, the day my dream stopped, that must have been when the incident actually began. What's this? Everyone! Keep your guard up, I guess. It doesn't seem human. A shadow? No, this is... It's not a shadow, obviously. It can't be. The same model as me? Your, I guess. Huh? Sorry I'm late. Is everyone okay? Yes, for now. I need you to provide backup for I guess. All right. All right. Who are you? Why are you doing this? I'm Metis. I've come to protect you. What? Protect me? These people pose a threat to you. That is why they will be eliminated. What are you saying? I won't let you hurt them! Then I have no choice. For your sake, I'll have to force you to back down. You must stand aside. It's Mattis. Give me a sec. I'll scan the target.
Damn it. Are you okay? Please be more careful. Please don't resist. You know, you don't need to She will not kill you. So If she know she's gonna kill you with the next hit, she will just not hitting. So I don't use any medicine. Here. What's this? Don't tell me. Okay guys, I think that's it for today's video. Um, thank you for watching and I hope you like this new series. You know, it's just directly after Persona 3 Journeys since it's actually the same game, the same uh, DVD. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna play it until the end but uh, I'm mostly gonna skip through the dungeon you know if I could use cheat I could use, uh, I will use one maybe later on in the game so I don't grind as much since yeah the gameplay is not really interesting uh, it's too much a dungeon crawling with a little story but the story that is exists is actually really great so yeah we'll focus on that of course all those battle will be shown and yeah that's it it's a great story I will give a commentary on every battle and every single bit that I think interesting anyway that's it hope you like it and have a nice day